Do do do. Mousy Mouse. Hey guys, Mousy Mouse here. And, um, back with another video now. Okay. I know lots of you are going to complain. It has been a month. Uh, it's been a busy month, mind you. And uh, I'm actually recording my birthday, which is the 3rd of June. So that's, isn't that lovely, eh? Um, I, I decided, you know, I haven't filmed anything for a while. Um, so I'm going to film it. Uh, an episode, which is this <laughs> that you're watching. Uh, so yeah, uh, this is the house we were working on. Now I'm actually going to be just changing a few things around the outside. We didn't do enough balconies, um, in my opinion. Anyway, since because, well, I, I'm sure all of you are aware. I'm actually working on a new mini game server, um, which you guys should all enjoy. Um, I'm also a developer on a a mini game server right now called the Respawn Network. So make sure you check it out. Make sure to put the IP in the description for you. Awesome server. Um, I'm sure you'll all love it. Of course, keep playing Telecraft too. Um, but there's that's another server you can also hop on, and it's got some really good cool games. I've actually been playing quite a bit of Point Runner uh, in between when I've been developing and stuff. I highly recommend you guys go on and check that out. Anyway, um, back to this video. So uh, yeah, I'm just I just wanted to add a couple of these balconies because basically there's just not enough and yeah balconies because we can. Um, of course, this part two is supposed to be interior. I know that I'm not an idiot, and I think we should put half slabs in between these. I've actually been building massive versions of these houses um, for this new lobby that I'm creating and man it's it's quite something I'm not sure if you guys have seen my live streams recently I've started I've, I've been trying to stream quite a bit more so make sure you go ahead and follow me over at um, I think it's twitch.tv slash mousey miles yeah it is okay so yeah make sure you guys head over there make sure to check me out there um, so inside I think, now there's a few things we can do. We can do the floor the same colour as the ceiling, which is what we are going to do probably. Or we could use spruce wood or something like that for the floor. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and use this because, yeah, uh, I prefer to keep the roof colour the same colour as what we're using for the floors. Because obviously we want all the floors on each level to be the same. <laughs> Hey guys, so now that's all filled in, you can do a third floor if you really must, however I'm not going to do that, I am going to be having a little floor here, a little area I should say, um, let me just, oh. yeah let me fill the spin, so um, basically this is kind of like a little attic type area and we'll put some hay bales or something, I don't know, actually no it's not a barn, why are we going to put hay bales, let's put some bookshelves. Maybe some piston crate type looking things, you know what I mean. Um, and let's maybe break this out and put a beam going across. Yeah, okay, so now the next step is we actually want to fill in these um, gaps in between everything because nobody wants a gappy house, do they? No, you want a, a lovely house that looks awesome and is fun to be in. Okay, there we go, starting to uh, take shape now up here. So what we're going to do with this, so oh, hang on, I brought that one there up too high. What we're going to actually do with this bit right here is, we'll pr uh, hang on, let me see. Yeah, if we do this, so you have this little shape now, and then up here we'll do the same. Mm, yeah, let's just keep it, because, yeah, why not. Uh, I'll choose online. Let's see, what else? Uh, yeah, okay, so now we'll find a place for the staircase. Now the staircase really, I I prefer having it a bit like real life, so you come in through your house and then you have your staircase like right here I guess would be a good spot. Because here I don't know about you know anywhere else in the world, but normally um, if you go into a house here in the UK, they have their staircase um, like right as you come in the door. So you can just kind of go up. Says, actually, hang on. Yeah, let's do it here. This is this is perfect. Um, yeah. Okay. So let's cut this away. 
So uh, yeah, you come through your door, you go up the, straight up the stairs. It's all it's all well and good, and you can still have access to this window. And we'll probably put a kitchen behind the, the stairs here. Uh, so now let's go up here. Obviously, safety first. Uh, okay, sorry about that, guys. Um, so I was looking at it, and I did attempt to build a chimney here. It's not going to work there. Uh, I'll show you why. Top. Um, this window's in the way basically um, I tried to make it curve up here and it just it just yeah it's not gonna work sadly so we shall just be I, I mean uh, you could do a chimney here but for the sake of it I'm just can't be bothered to be honest doing a chimney um, well it's not that I can't be bothered it's that make it right if we do it on this side it's gonna to have to go through that roof so ideally you would do it here but ideally you wouldn't have this weird gap you'd probably do a three wide window here and then have a three at the back or two threes even maybe even short maybe just get rid of this and have this door directly in that corner but sadly <laughs> it's it's obviously not so um, I'm just going to go ahead and place a seat here, like we had said, and a seat here. I'm going to go ahead and get some signs out, just uh, pop them on. Now, I'm not the best at interior, I'm going to say that. Um, my interior may be a bit old school, kind of. Um, I, I don't know because you know most people do chairs like oh yeah I'm gonna get a fence but slab top and slab and slab slab up the half slab on top and I'm gonna put a thing behind it um, but that's more for modern you know like that in medieval just ugh you know like I don't, I don't know what to say really um, I I wouldn't do it I don't recommend doing it that's what that's it really. Hmm. Yeah, so bushes, anvils, music stuff. Boom. Ha ha! Look what I have found there. <laughs> that is, so you're just sitting on your sofa looking at your painting, and yeah, there we go. Perfect. So, around here, now every Minecraft house needs a kitchen for, you know, cooking all that pork chop and making all your crafty stuff and your anvil and making your potions and anything a uh, kitchen minecraft thing would do um, so we'll get some potions and everything now, I'm sure you've seen my kitchens in the last episode if you've watched uh, no not the last episode of this series uh, the um, what was it thingy the last oh the stone rustic house that was it and yes, by the way, guys, you can access this crafting or not. There goes my <laughs> my little thing. Uh, we'll do it. Mm. Oh yeah, hang on. We can do furnaces there, and then have have a um. Yeah, furnaces there. To a cauldron. Or oh, oh here here look hang on. The cauldron there, right, and then we'll have our anvil right behind. Actually, we have anvils over here, but I don't know, they're plant pots. They're not anvils. Shh, don't tell anyone. Um, anyway, let's, you know, they don't need an anvil. This is a non-anvil kitchen. There we go. Oh, you can't see that one. Nice. Now, of course, the, <laughs> the kitchen definitely not finished. This is awful. Need some. Uh... Oh, is so this not gonna? Not a thing. No. Let's cheat a bit, shall we? And that is in the complete wrong place. There we go. See? Yeah. <laughs> I totally did not cheat that. Um, let's get a uh, 
a little stove going. Oh yes, every Minecraft house needs chests, so they're they're a safe bet. If we um, I don't know, chest, 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 in the middle, cactus. No, um, just just find stuff really. More bushes. Can never have too many bushes. Yeah. Yeah, more bushes. That's no, I don't like it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. If we do this, then in the middle we can have a tree with two ender chests. Oh, hang on. Can we store Grandpa's chair? Yes. <laughs> Grandpa's chair. Okay. And then right here we can have more chests. No, I, I'm getting bored of chests. We need something else. Uh, yeah, bookshelves and a thing. Thing? A whatever you call this. I mean, you could do fancy bookshelves, but I'm just going to... Yeah, we can't even fit an enchanting table. So let's go upstairs and let's um, do stuff. Okay, guys, so I have came up with a little maze of stuff here. <laughs> that's that's the words I can describe it with. So come up the stairs, you walk down here, there's room in here. I've actually added bookshelves in here. There, I'll show you the layout. Uh, there's a room up here. I know the path's a bit odd. Actually, I think, you know... I'll move this here. There we are. Room. So it's a three bedroom, I guess. And then, well, two bedroom and one bathroom. We'll put a bathroom. Uh, so, yeah, that's that's the layout that I came up with. Here, I'm gonna put some little uh, bookshelves and stuff, just just like that. Just so there's something there, you know. I like having this little bookshelf there, and then, yeah, okay, we'll leave that like that. And then in here, what I've done is put a bookshelf. Now, what you do is you put bookshelves in the wall, and then you come this way, and you, and then you get like a little cupboard. See, <laughs> if the door textures work properly, you you would. But and then we have a little bedside table thing. This kid's got a mushroom because he's cool. Okay. Um. This kid's got a mushroom, you see? Yeah. They make green. <laughs> now, I have, I've only recently started using carpet and builds. I really am starting to like it. The kid doesn't need wardrobe things. And we'll do a strange pattern. There we go. Kids room. Awesome. Now we'll go... This one here will be the master bedroom. Yeah. And we'll get a bed. And we'll go... Boink. And then we'll get... Just so they can play their music when they're, you know, in bed. They don't have a mushroom, they have a rose. And... Carpets. Now oh, they're, they're adults, so they're not going to have a child's carpet. So let's get some red and some grey. They're boring. Boring people. Red and grey carpet. Who has red and grey carpet? And what pattern are we going to do? Yeah, we'll just do checkers for this. Like I said, boring. Yeah. <laughs> now, I, uh, what I want to do is I want to move this wall this way. So it's uh, a bit nicer in there. And then in here, we have more space as well. So that's that room. It does look weird though, doesn't it? Um, to be honest, we don't even need the bookshelves. <laughs> Let's get rid of them. It's a kid's room. Kid, kid ain't gonna read. 
I think. I don't know, it's fine if you like reading, okay? There's nothing wrong with it, but kids... Kids don't tend to read, um, so... <laughs> yeah. There we go. Nice, nice. He's got, oh, look, he's got a little little thing here. Okay, so you go into his room. I know what room we're going to do here. Um, so it's a very odd shape. This will be the bathroom, then. So we're going to have a shower, and I think we're going to have a black glass shower. Just so those dirty perves don't get you. Okay. Um, might as well go the whole way up. Jeez, we need some lights. Let's get some torches down. Are we doing them? F yeah. Four high? Okay. Put a torch here. And a torch. Oh, actually, this room money really needs one torch. This room. Do torch. 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 Okay. And the hallway needs some light as well. Um. Oh, oh. I've got a better idea. Done. Okay. <laughs> so let's head back in here. Uh, so we've got this little thing here. And we will also get a little shower head thing. So it's a shower head, okay. Now I know we can't um, actually carpet. No, we can't. C we can't have carpet in a bathroom. Isn't that? Isn't that lovely? Let's put a sink here. Ah, oh, yes. We're gonna have a double. No, we can't have a double sink. Damn it. Double sink. Oh, living, living the posh life here. Um. <laughs> and yeah, let's see. Hopper. Uh, Need a hopper toilet. To toilet. To toilet. Toilets need a seat. I mean a um, back. That's the toilet seat. Toilets need a, a little a little back. There's our toilet. <laughs> so like oh yeah, we'll put them here. So like you have your towels on like these ladders. And, like you come in and you pick your towel. Or isn't you like having a shower, you know doing your thing and you walk over here you get a towel dry yourself off and you do your little your little poopy poop and then you go here and you wash your hands because you have to wash your hands after you go to the toilet just put this top floor in because I can okay we could do a floor up here um, but I'm not going to I'm just gonna leave it empty uh, if you were going to do a floor, just plan it out and everything. I mean, it doesn't make sense not to have a floor. Because obviously there's a space, but we've run out of time. And I do not want to do a part three. And what is this thing? Mousy tower. <laughs> He's making fun of a tower I made. <laughs> anyway, that's it for this video. Um, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.